and welcome back to another video so today i'm just going to show you how to do a really simple and easy glitter fade so i'm just showing you all the products that i'm going to be using here this glamour gel from brill bird is absolutely stunning it's a lovely lovely bright pink so i'm just going in here and making sure that all my bases are down and obviously i'm going to have two plain nails in this that you'll have seen from the thumbnail so i'm just making sure that they're done first and then we'll get into the glitter fade So first of all, I'm getting my white base down. Um, I'm creating a line in the middle and then a line either side of that to try and get it central or as close to as central as I can. And then I will fill in that in the middle with the white gel paint with a bigger brush just so it doesn't take me as long to fill it in as it would with this striper brush. So once that is cured, I'm then going in with my Glamour Gel from Brill Bird. These are actually pretty difficult to blend out just because they are so pigmented. There is a lot of colour in these. They are absolutely amazing. I just love them. But I did do it in the end and it looked really, really good. So it's definitely worth messing about with them for a little bit longer. So I'm just popping some of that on first, just getting some product on the nail. And then we'll work on blending it out. So once I'm finished blending and making sure that it's exactly how I want it, which took way longer than I wanted it to, um, I'm then just going in with Minx from Sparkle Supplies UK. As you all know, I do have a discount code for this brand, so definitely have a look in my description box to be able to get that and the link to the website. And I'm just popping this on top. I really, really love this glitter. It's so bright. Um, obviously, we've got a bright base underneath it, but the glitter alone is just amazing. And... It's also got a bluey like sort of shift to it, which is really, really cool. And I love blue, obviously, so that always works for me. So I'm just gently blending this out and placing it exactly where I want it. And then I will pop it into the lamp to cure fully. So once that is cured, I'm now going in with some flexi tape. I don't remember exactly where I got this one from, but you can get it from all places. I'm pretty sure that Sparkle sells this as well. So if you're going to nip to the website to buy some glitter, you might as well add this to your basket. So I'm just cutting it to how long I want it. I always cut it for a bit longer than I actually need it, because as you'll see here, I always manage to mess it up. It's really, really, really thin tape, which is brilliant because it's really, it really is flexible and that is amazing. But I'm too heavy handed for this, so I ended up pulling the end off. I tucked it underneath by accident, so I just thought I might as well get it off because it's going to be too thick for the nail now. And then I'm just going to pick that up and place it either side of the white to create like an outline.
once I've done that and then just going to cut off the excess I'm going to apply a layer of give me strength so all the glitter is nice and smooth and then a layer of top coat I went for gloss but obviously you could do matte as well I think that'd look really effective or you could do the side bits matte and the middle bit gloss or the other way around the possibilities for this design are endless and it's really really effective I hope you enjoyed this video thank you so so much for watching please subscribe if you don't already and I'll be back really really soon bye